Good evening everyone, it's PTG Gobbo here, back with another video tutorial. This time we're going to be learning how to maintain and clean your paintbrushes. Um, it's quite an easy thing to do, uh, something that I highly recommend, um, simply because otherwise you would just be going through brushes left, right and centre, and this way just helps prolong the life of them. So first up, what I have with me is the Master's Brush Cleaner. This single-handedly is probably the best purchase I've ever made. So what it is, it's just a little little tub of soap and cleaner. And it is just magic, easily magic. <laughs> um, I have some water, some nice fresh water. I have my little paint brushes there, which we're going to try and clean. I've got a couple of different types. I've got a basic cheap synthetic brush which I use for um, bases and stuff like that. I've then got a games and gears like base coat brush which again I use quite often and then we've got a detail brush from the army painter so again they're all not in great shape but I thought we'd just give them a nice little clean. So first thing we want to do so we open up the tub of our master's brush cleaner then what I do is I get a little bit of the water and just swirl it all over the soap just to try and get it a little bit damp nice so we're going to start with our hobby detail brush bit of water and we're going to just go around in circles twisting the brush as we go just to try and get some of the gunk out but also to try and look after the brushes so as you can see there it's all in then something that I do in the crease of my hand I've got one of my lines there I can't remember which one that is probably a lifeline or a something or other line who cares but you can use that as a guide to twirl so as you draw back you can twist your brush and it starts to go into a pointed shape again the more you do the more it goes and starting to look nice and sharp and do it once more there we go so if you leave that one to dry overnight and then tomorrow it'll be a little bit stiffer like when it's brand new so it'll look really nice um, just a drop of water when you start mixing with your paintbrush and it'll be ready to go nice and easy so one of three done so we'll then go for our base coat brush same principle so a little dab of water swirl them around get the soap in in the bristles nice and gunked up look and then use our little crease just twirling as we go trying to get nice and neat and so as we go you're starting to get a little bit finer So he's got a nice little point which is good so he's ready for base coating again so we'll leave him overnight and he'll be fine and so I haven't tried this beforehand so this is going to be an interesting one so this is one of my old minging toothbrush, uh, toothbrushes blimey uh, one of my old paint brushes don't drink the paint water guys right bit of water into our little magic pot again swirling them about okay and let's give this a go see if it comes out well or if it makes me look silly which wouldn't surprise me <laughs> to be honest actually he's doing all right There you go, as you start to draw in backwards, just 
starting to maintain the shape of the original brush. There you go. So nice and pulled together, ready for destroying the next time I do a base coat on a base of sand and everything like that. So yeah, there we go guys. A nice and simple one. Um, I hope it is useful for you and highly highly recommend this is not a paid advert by the way <laughs> this is just me basically presenting you your chance at redemption for all the hours you've spent not cleaning your brushes this is the thing to save it uh, truly recommend it um, as an aside if you don't want to buy this you can buy um, in England anyway VO5 matte clay it has a slightly banana -y flavour and smell, um, but it does a very similar thing for about three pounds. Um, yeah, VO5 men's matte clay is a good alternative, but this this is just like a genie in a bottle. This is go for it. Okay, I think that's everything. Thank you so much for watching. Um, please like, share, subscribe, and I would love to hear your feedback. Um, I would love to get some more ideas from you guys. What you want to see what you want me to talk about, if you want to be involved in this show as well, give me a shout and we can arrange something and talk about some hobby. Thank you very much guys and take care.